hello guys and welcome back to my youtube channel so today i'll be showing you guys one of the easiest ways to deep condition your hair with a few ingredients from your kitchen so first of all we're going to need olive oil i'm sure you can find that somewhere in your kitchen so olive oil is perhaps one of the healthiest oils for your hair it adds shine and luster to the hair it packs a lot of moisture in the scalp and keeps dryness far far away from your hair and one thing i like about it is that it also reduces scalp irritation now the next item we use is honey honey helps draw moisture all the way from the air to your hair and it has both antimicrobial and anti-inflammatory properties that help prevent dandruff and soothe and itchy scalp so the next ingredient is yogurt now as you can see this is unsweetened yogurt make sure it is unsweetened because sugar is a no-no if you want to keep yeast and flakes far away from your scalp so please make sure it is unsweetened yogurt then the next item we we'll use for this is obviously aloe vera now this has just been freshly scooped from the leaf and i haven't blended it so i'll go on ahead to blend this now the benefits of aloe vera for hair are many and if you combine it with olive oil honey and yogurt it will give you maximum benefits in no time so aloe vera repairs hair strands it takes care of itchy scalp it controls greasy hair it detangles hair it reduces frizziness it locks in moisture it smoothens natural curls it promotes hair growth and it also strengthens and conditions the natural hair so i'll just give it a few pulses and um i'll be okay because I don't want it to blend too much that it turns too watery because I want it to be in its jelly form as much as possible. So I think I'm okay now. So the aloe vera is all blended now and I went on ahead to filter it to do away with all the chaff and residue. So this is what it looks like. And right now, I'm just going to start the process. You can see it is all clean and pure. No chaff whatsoever. So, an important thing I want us to note is unruly and dry hair can be hard to manage. And a lack of moisture causes dry hair. So, it's always important to take special care by providing moisture to your dry hair and, and your scalp. So... When hair is well hydrated, it is more flexible, it is well defined and feels softer. That is why you need to deep condition your hair. So I don't know when last you've deep conditioned, but make sure you try this and you love the way your hair will feel. So right now I'm going to start with our main base for this deep conditioning and it is the yogurt. So in my bowl I'm going to add in 3 tablespoons of unsweetened yogurt. It depends on the length of your hair though. If your hair is much longer then you might need more scoops maybe like 4 or 5 tablespoons. But for me I'll be going with 3 tablespoons. And besides, we are going to be adding a few more ingredients to this. So 3 tablespoons is okay. So I know that I haven't really mentioned all the great benefits of yogurt for your hair. But don't worry, I'll be doing that subsequently in the video. So right now I'm going to add in the next ingredient which is honey. And I'll add in 2 tablespoons so honey works well as a binding agent and this means it's a good base to use as a hair mask if you want to include other ingredients now because you leave a mask on your hair for a longer period of time it promotes more intense healing nourishment and repairs the scalp than a regular conditioner would do so that is what honey does 
in any hair mask you use at all. And apart from that, it softens the hair, reduces frizz, it improves condition of natural hair, it restores shine, it reduces hair breakage and moisturizes dry hair and scalp. Now just take a look at that, just see how good it looks. Almost looks like something you would want to eat, but no, it goes right in your hair. Now the next ingredient I'll use is olive oil and I'll be adding in one tablespoon uh i added one tablespoon because i wanted to minimize the quantity of the liquid ingredients so olive oil is rich in antioxidant content and it helps maintain scalp and hair health it prevents the hair from cell damage and nourishes and also conditions the hair at the same time to improve its quality so the next ingredient i'll add is the aloe vera gel so i added one tablespoon at first but i later added in i think one or two more and that's because there was a consistency i was looking to get so i added it afterwards and if you want a thicker consistency then i would advise that you reduce the quantity of the liquid ingredients to get a desired consistency so i just give this thing a few turns and mixes because i'll be adding it back into the blender to blend it and i'm doing that so that all the ingredients will mix together well because i know if i'm using a spoon to do that i might not mix them the way i want so i'll put this in the blender now and give it a few pulses so yogurt is naturally high in healthy fats and proteins notice the keyword healthy healthy fats and proteins and this leaves your hair super shiny and loaded with maximum moisture yogurt softens the hair yogurt can be applied to the roots rubbed on the skin or spread on the hair strands depending on the hair problem you want to solve and the protein found in yogurt helps strengthen the hair shaft and it prevents split ends and hair damage yogurt contains lactic acid that helps to hydrate the hair so that after rinsing it it helps clear away any form of dead skin cells yogurt also has medical and cosmetic effects on the follicles on the scalp and on the roots of your hair and lastly yogurt is packed with several nutrients such as riboflavin and niacin and these help in strengthening the hair strands from the roots and vitamin b12 supports hair growth and prevents dandruff guys these are not all the benefits of yogurt for your hair but i just had to stop here because the list is endless so this is what i have now this is the consistency i have you can see that shiny kind of effect at the top of this mixture and that is the work of the olive oil now that's how it's going to leave your hair with a natural shine so this is the consistency i ended up with so like i said if you want a thicker consistency then you can just reduce the quantity of the other liquid ingredients so now i'm going to apply this on my hair i applied this and recorded it but unfortunately i lost the footage so i might not show you guys how it looked on my hair but uh, I think I'll insert a picture so you guys will see at the end of this video. So this is it. Just apply this thoroughly on your hair and allow it to sit for 20 minutes. Then you can wash it off with mild shampoo and water. A conditioner is not required guys. I repeat, you don't need to use a conditioner because the mask itself is a natural conditioner. And it's going to leave your hair very soft. So you can repeat this once a week for a shiny hair so that's all about today's video and i hope you enjoyed it thank you for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video